Johnny Storm was not very happy about Peter Parker buying the Baxter building. He therefore immediately flies out to talk with Peter Parker's supposed bodyguard, Spider-Man, and after they fought for a little bit, Spider-Man offers to show him what he's doing with the building. He calms down for a bit until he finds out that Spider-Man built the new Spider-Mobile without him. They then fight again where Spider-Man eventually sneaks off and comes back as Peter. He takes him to the lobby where he shows him the memorial of the Fantastic Four, telling him that he only bought the building so it wouldn't fall into bad hands and that he's just holding it till the day the Fantastic Four comes back.